Well hello again and welcome back. Today we're heading out on Big Bertha, the LT. And meeting up with the guys out of the Eagles again, meeting them in Carrick Fergus. And we're going to head up for a run up around the north coast again. So, let's get underway. It's uh, getting towards the end of September now. This might be one of the last runs of the year, I'm thinking. The weather's fantastic, thank goodness. Because it was a miserable day yesterday. But it's made up for it now, it's beautiful. I'll see you in Carrick. Here we are in Carrick Fergus and the sun is playing tricks with us. There seems to be a bit of mist which I'm sure will burn off. Beautiful sunny morning in Tandragee and hit a couple of dull spots on the way up the road. But I think it's going to be a good day. Time for breakfast. The joys of a big top box. All the gear. Flask water at lunch. Cheese and ham and pickle sandwich and a cup of coffee. Couldn't beat it with a big stick. All right, mate. Yes. Yes. Ah. Cleland's arrived on his KTM. Yeah. Hooligan bike. Yeah. 990 cc's. That's nearly a thousand, you know. It is almost. A you don't want to go to a thousand, no, that would be just madness, wouldn't it? Like? There's no point going to a thousand, you just have to be way too big. <laughs> yeah. I can feel that thing vibrating. <laughs> the yeah. the commander, the commander's here now. Mr. Ducati. So, Germany, where's KTM's Germany? Austria. Austria. Yeah. The, the, the rising sun and Italy. Very good. We're being they're being well represented. Flip me, here's Marcus. Uh, uh, three years now. Love it, no problems. Um, it took a while, uh, Everybody's weighing in. Right, dude. How's it going? Yeah, that's not, I, don't do that. I don't do that either. I don't do that either. Uh, but I think this is the last man. The straggler, apparently. And the song was, Don't You Need Somebody to Love? <laughs> this might be the full entourage now. We're ready for the off. He's in front, which might which might be dangerous. Thank you. 
becoming somewhat of a traditional stop for us. Same place in Ballycastle. On who? On us old men. <laughs> Ballycastle, lots of bikers yeah, about today as well, usual. We're We've just fueled up in Ballycastle, now we're heading to Burt's. We'll be getting fed up to say this. These guys that you tortured, literally <laughs> just putting the kettle on. <laughs> <laughs> Only now. Oh, there you go. Perfectly timed. <laughs> well, how'd you have a, what was your run up like? Nice and relaxed. Yep. Nice and chilled over the hills. Yeah. Bit of mist. Oh, no, no. no, no. no, no. Leaving Birch. Yeah, I can see, see you next year. We have to make sure this happens again next year. Yeah. Hey, Tim, what to do? Something. We're going to go over the Torah Heads scenic route. just come down from Tor Head and now apparently we're heading to a place called the Aura so we're going up over the Aura Simon knows where he's going Well, we're up the top of the Aura, O-R-R-A. I'll tell you something about the Aura. There's no set. There's no, There's no signal. Phone service. Yeah. No phone service. No phone service at the Aura. It's a bit barren up here. We've just followed the river Dunn the whole way from the sea up. Up Glen Dunn. And at no doubt, it comes out of a hole in the ground up there somewhere. Very nice. Yeah. <laughs> that sounds like a 2CV. Like <laughs> it does sound more like a scooter. It is very 2CV. That's a view looking down over the rest of Northern Ireland. See you. We'll be in touch. All the best. Bye. So that's it. They're departing for towards Belfast, and I'm heading further west. Another good Eagles run. Maybe the last of the year. Until the next time, all the best.